Hey guys, today we're going to show you how you can attach a PDF version of the gift cards your customers are buying to the email that is sent to the recipients with our Yeet WooCommerce gift cards plugin. This is super useful in case your customers want to print that gift card and then give it personally to their loved ones as a present. Before we get into it, let me remind you, of course, to like this video, subscribe to our channel and hit that bell down below so that you know every time we have a new video for you. Now, let's get to it. Something users usually ask is whether they can purchase a gift card and print it themselves in order to personally gift it to their loved ones instead of sending it in an email. Indeed, they can do this. First of all, let me show you where you can enable the PDF file to be sent in the email that is sent after the gift card is purchased. Let's go to E, Gift Cards, Recipient and Delivery, and we're going to scroll down to the Email Options and Customization section, and right here we have the Attach PDF option. If we enable this, a PDF file with the gift card is going to be sent in the gift card email. So let's enable this. As you can see right here, we can also choose the name of that PDF file. Mine is Yid gift card. And here we have a placeholder for the gift card ID and another placeholder for the unique ID. I'm going to save this. Let's go to the side. I'm going to select this virtual gift card. So I'm going to get this virtual gift card for a friend that's celebrating her birthday soon. First, I'm going to upload a custom image I have there. Something to keep in mind is that the images that users upload are not really stored in the site. So if I refresh this page right now, the image will disappear. And I'm going to select $25 for this gift card so she can get something nice from this shop. We're keeping this as it is. I want it delivered today. I'm going to add her name right here. My name, a message to customize the gift card. Now, you might have noticed that I didn't add her email. That's because I'm not going to add her email, but I'm going to add my own email so that this virtual gift card is sent to me instead of her. This way, even though it's a gift card for Jane, I'm going to be the one that is going to receive the email and I'm going to be able to download the PDF file and print it so I can give it to her personally. I'm going to add to cart and purchase this gift card. Great, so I have bought the virtual gift card. I'm going to set this order as completed and then we're going to see the email that I'm going to receive because I added my own email as the recipient email. Here is the email that anyone getting a virtual gift card should receive. Your gift card. Hi Jane, you have received this gift card from Carla. You sit on our online shop. My custom image, the amount I chose, my custom message, the gift card code, the QR code, and apply your gift card code button that will redirect me to the site and automatically apply the gift card code. And right here is the PDF file. If you remember, the PDF file name was it gift card, the gift card ID, and the unique ID. I'm going to click here, and here's my virtual gift card as a PDF file. So I can go ahead and print this file put it in a nice envelope with a ribbon and then give it personally to Jane as a gift. As you can see, this is really easy to do and makes for a perfect gift. Okay guys, that's how you can enable the option to attach a PDF version of the gift card to the related email. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, please give this video a big thumbs up and we'll meet again for our next video.